try taking a tiny ball and putting it in a goal with a stick on a large field while some of the nation's best field hockey players are giving chase trying to stop you. It's a tough task, and while each goal only counts for one point for your team in the actual game, on the stat sheet a player gets two points for a goal. Each assist will earn a player one point. Hazleton area senior Jillian Bookman made it to 100 total career points this season. She's one of only six Lady Cougars to hit the 100 point mark. Like I said, in this program where there's been so many players, there's only been five before her, so it's a kind of a hard mark to do. Yeah, I think a lot of that has to do with the competitive yeah, okay. nature of our Wyoming Valley Conference and um, the difficulty of our schedule because even the games out of our conference, Mr. Barlett does a great job of setting us up with real powerhouse programs. Our area produces some of the top field hockey talent in the country, so 100 points is no small achievement. Hazleton area head field hockey coach Mary Kelly says Bookman is one of the best athletes at a school filled with standouts. You see, when Bookman isn't outrunning defenders in field hockey, she's outrunning the field in track. Last season, she was third in District 2 in the 400-meter dash for Hazleton area. Her talent has impressed colleges. Bookman has verbally committed to play field hockey at Kutztown University. She's also held the attention of opposing high school teams. She's been the marked person uh, for the for, for opponents, so uh, opponents know that she's going to be in the middle of the action all the time, so they're going to put their best defenders on her. Still, she's been able to, you know, uh, get this accomplishment, uh, you know, halfway through her senior year, and uh, and the Lady Cougar Field Hockey team itself is uh, doing very well, too, and uh, Jill would be the first person to tell you that she's more happy with the team success than she is as an individual. Bookman did compliment everyone on the Lady Cougars roster, including including the younger players who are still working to earn time on the field. I mean, they're part of everything we do. They're the support system. They help in with games. Everybody in this team plays a part in every single win, every single loss, anything that we do. I mean, I'm so proud of them. I mean, they're coming up, they're learning more, and we're just getting stronger as a team. So yeah, I'm proud of them, yeah. Jill sets the bar. She really does. And we do have a big group of freshmen this year. We have nine freshmen and she takes the time with them, she teaches them, she encourages them, but she does it in a way that, that they, they're open to her, you know, they, they allow her to teach her, uh, to teach them, and, and I just feel that, that that's a big thing for our program. And so after another strong season where the team got district silver medals, it seems Bookman will leave the program in good hands as the quest for gold continues. Strong leaders setting strong examples have helped the Lady Cougars stay in the championship hunt. Last year, Megan Reed, I looked up to her a lot. She actually got 100 career points too. She, um, she's a really humble player, she was quiet and I really looked up to her. Humble is a word Kelly used several times when talking about Bookman. So what's harder than getting to 100 career points in field hockey? Trying to get Jillian Bookman to brag about it. I mean, it was exciting, but I was just kind of like, you know, it's just another, another goal. <laughs> it's just, it was a game. I mean, it was really big because we needed that first goal to really get us started for our, our win. But I mean, it's just another goal, but I was excited and everybody was really happy for me and that felt good too. I think a, a real tribute to her, to her character and her humility is the fact that her teammates wanted her to reach that goal probably more than she did. And during the game when she did hit her 100 points, they went they were ecstatic. I mean, they were truly happy for her. And, and I feel like that is because of her hard work and her humility and just the character of, of the young woman. Bookman isn't only leaving behind a bunch of dents in the back of the cages at Hazleton area. Been doing this a real long time. And you, you get players and they come and go and you'll remember some of them, some of them touch your heart. Jill's one player who does. And when I think of her, I can, I can see her how she drives the ball, how strong she looks as, as an athlete. She's a very strong young woman, both, both mentally and physically. And I think that, that her strength, her athleticism, and her humility are things that, for me, I'll always remember. For SSPTV Sports, I'm Ken Kara.